Hi, this is Mr. Ward, and I'm doing another video on the 2018 Math MCAS for 8th grade. So we have number 27. Amy and Simon bought each bought a pair of shorts and some t-shirts. Each pair of shorts costs the same amount, and each pair of each t-shirt costs the same amount. <clears throat> so Amy paid $60 for one pair of shorts and two t-shirts. Simon paid $75 for one pair of shorts and three t-shirts. What is the cost in dollars for one pair of shorts? This is a system of equations. So I'm going to use the text box for this. It's a fairly simple system. Um, I'm going to call S shorts and T t-shirts. So S, S. So we have one pair of shorts for Amy plus two t-shirts for Amy and she paid $60. And Simon bought one pair of shorts uh, and three t-shirts and paid $75. And so we want to find out what the cost of one pair of shorts is. Okay. Okay, so we want to find out what the price of one pair of shorts is. Now, what we really need to do is probably substitute in this situation. You could do elimination, uh, but you're going to need to get a matching coefficient for uh, the T uh, part because we want the shorts. I mean, I could just subtract these, but it would wipe out the shorts. I guess I could do that, and then I could use that to find a uh, T-shirt. So let's actually do that. I like that better uh, than the other options. So I'm going to do, I'm going to go here and I'm going to subtract these equations. I reverse the order of them, okay, so that I would end up with positive numbers, okay. So, so I know that I will get no S's, and I'll get just one T when I do three T minus two T, um, and then I'll get 25. So I know that a T-shirt is 25. So now I can go back into one of these equations and plug in 25. So I'll use substitution. I'll do the second equation, uh, the one for Amy, S plus two times 25 equals 60. And that's S uh, plus 50 equals 60, and you can probably mental math pretty quickly that S equals 10, because we subtract 50 from both sides. We'll get $10 for a pair of shorts.